Hi everyone, I'm going to teach you guys today how to um, do a different way of learning your multiplication. Um, I know when you're looking at this right now, it seems a little bit intimidating. Um, but I actually found this idea, idea from my son's teacher. Um, and she had recommended hanging up numbers with um, their counterparts for multiplication with the um, with the answers and it's it's actually really easy I'm gonna show you right now how to do it I'm gonna use one that's lower so we're gonna start off with seven and plus seven is a little bit more difficult to remember I know that when I was going through and making these I had to keep checking because I wasn't sure if I was correct but the way that this works is that um, like if you want to do seven times nine you start from this first number and you count to nine so seven so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So then you know that the answer is 63. And then if you did seven times 10, it would be 70. Um, but the way that this works is it's gonna, your child has something to look at. And uh, they're gonna be a lot faster counting um, by ones than they are gonna be counting or trying to multiply um, with a different chart and counting that out because then you have to find out the length and the width. Um, I know that this is probably something that would have been easier for me to learn when I was learning. I got distracted a lot during math time. Um, so I hope that this is something that's going to help you. Um, let's try a different number. Um, so if they want to do 9 or 8 times 1, what's 8 times 1? Well, they find the very first number and count and that's 1. Um, the hardest part about this is remembering to start um, with, with by ones because then you're going to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, I know that when I tried to have my son do this in a demonstration earlier, he had a tendency of going, skipping this number and going one, two, three, four. Um, because, well, when you play board games, you don't count this space, you count the next space when you're moving on. Um, I hope that you understand this. If you have any questions, you can email me or send me a message on my blog. Remember to check me out at figuringitout101.com. And um, don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day. Thanks.